Hello everybody, my name is Keyboard Slapper and today I am playing the 2010 PS3 Classic Heavy Rain, a game that I have never played but I thought I should as I've had a PS3 for about a year now and it's just sitting here collecting dust so I thought I would take my time out of my busy schedule, wink wink, to wipe off at least the first five layers of dust just so I can get to the disk drive and then uh, play me some Heavy Rain. A lot of my friends have told me this game is just really depressing so with me having the psychotic mind that I have just thought this game's going to be hilarious. I've never played any bit of this game. I've only seen trailers, I haven't seen any of the story, and I haven't seen any of the gameplay, so I'm quite eager to play it. The only reason that I didn't before was the fact that I didn't have a PS3, and the fact that at the time it just looked like it was just quick time events, and I couldn't be asked. One half-naked man. One serial killer. One seriously bad game of guess who. <laughs> Don't move too hard, you'll break something. Oh, now you've done it. Control the animation speed for crude jokes, such as Hold R2 and walk with the left stick. Wait, what? So R2 is basically like a throttle. Is this guy a robot? Meow. Quickly hit L2 to do drifts. Meow. That was nearly a drift. Ooh, the outside world. Hey, neighbor. You want to see my junk? Hey, Steve. Look at this. I'm naked. Is this my kid's room? Oh, no, this is creepy. Anytime you can listen to what your character is thinking by pressing L2. Well, judging by his face, it looks like he's thinking about internet porn. Funny. I don't remember installing this camera. Scratch my nipple. Turn. Walk forward. What's wrong with you? R2. Ooh, a note. Don't work too hard. Don't work too hard. Well, now I've got to lift this piece of paper. Urgh. Urgh. Oh, why is it so heavy? Let's get out of this hellhole. Ooh, hallway. Is that a bird? Hey, bird. How's it going? I'm just going to take this capsule of cyanide and put it in your feeding tray. Have a nice day. Fucking birds. Hello there, pretty thing. What brings you here? Oh, yeah, there's a six axis thing on here. I completely forgot that was a thing. Okay, let's try and give him some bleeding gums. Go! <laughs> How come I'm worn out and you're not? Stage two, shaving. Don't do it too quick, you'll cut yourself. Or not? Guess you can't cut yourself with an electric razor, really, can you? Your face is terrifying me. You're enjoying this way too much. And you are shaving. Though I'm pretty sure it's not taking any hair off. Am I the only one seeing this? His hand looks like it's covered in blackheads. It looks like he has some form of infectious disease. So he's got frog spawn all over him. Why does he look like he has a tear in his eye? Is this really a sad moment for him? No, cut yourself. No, he didn't cut himself. Oh, but we can really see his frog spawn hand then. God, he's some form of creepy reptile creature. Hey, good looking. What you got cooking? I feel like someone's watching me. Oh well, better get naked. I am the Virgin Mary. Oh God, seriously? I'd love it if he just stood there and just waited for his wife to come through the door. He looks like he's presenting himself. Oh, oh yeah, you sexy rub, you sexy rub. Quicker? Oh, all right. Oh yeah, you want it quicker, do you? Oh, you want it faster? Can you? uh Oh, you changed your underwear and everything. Okay, that's a little bit cleaner, I guess. I would not have chosen that color though. I'm gonna be creepy and walk into my kid's room in my underwear. Did my son draw this? That's fucking terrible. Go downstairs in your underwear. Yes. I should no. get dressed before going downstairs. No, oh, you ruined it. This game is a really nice looking game. I'll give it that. But this part just seems kind of ridiculous. Very easy to take the piss out of. Oh, well. All right, let's get changed. No, that's not my color. Let's go for this one. How about that one? No, that's not my color. No, how about that one? My color. No, no. Oh, oh, let's go for this one. There we go. Look at those jeans and magically shirt. That's convenience. What a lovely day. Now, I definitely don't remember installing that camera. Characters' thoughts will change with the situation. Garden or work. Oh, I've heard there's some good TV porn on right now. No, no, I must resist. That's not porn. Aha, uh -huh, here's the office. So this is where the work happens. Everything can be done in slow motion, but everyone just sees you moving really slowly. Slowly plonking buttocks upon the chair. We are now finally seated. I'm just going to draw a straight line here. Whoops, that's wonky. I'm going to draw another straight line here. Nope, oh, that's also wonky, and it's completely crisscrossed. Oh, you want me to uh, take those bags, do you? Yeah, oh, yeah. let me just take those. Ha <laughs> ha, joking. Oh, le no, let me take those. Ha ha ha, joking again. Never mind, I'll do it. Yeah, you take that, bitch. Uh, there should be plates in the living room cupboard. Okay, where are we going? Living room cupboard. You say living room cupboard? Did you say living room cupboard? Where's the living room? Where's the cupboard? I thought I asked you to take care of the plates. Yeah, I'm getting there. How is this a living room? This is clearly a dining room. We don't put bloody tables and chairs like this in a living room. That door is always sticking. Give it a big tug. That's what she said. That's the set my mother gave us. 
Be careful, okay? Don't worry. I wouldn't want to be responsible for a diplomatic incident with your mother. Wow, that was the most robotic response I've ever heard. Let's see if we can break one of these plates. Hey, Ethan, you said you were going to be careful. Are they sorry, broken? No, they're not, gentle. bitch. Careful. Ethan! I know, I know. I'm being careful. I am! What's wrong with that? You just put the plate down. It's not like I'm smashing them like I hopefully do this time. Whoa, where did all these words come from? And why are they orbiting around me? Ah, ah, ah. Can I do anything to help? No thanks. I should be able to manage. Bitch. Jason looks happy. Yeah. Well done. It's not exactly hard to keep a 10 year old happy. Surely just spin him around in circles and give him custard. Me first! No, me first! What are we doing? Easy, fellas. You can both have a turn. Have a turn on what? Uh, this doesn't seem dangerous at all. Child services. Child services. There you go. Dizzy dinosaurs. Now give them custard. And there you go. See, I told you 10-year-olds are simple. Oh, look at Jason. He's so depressed. Hey, Jason, you're 10. Yeah, well, you're fucking helicopter. Take this. Planes. Far superior. I really want to punch that kid on the right in the face. He's annoying me. Surely the dumb thing is to let your kids win instead of beating them up with plastic swords. Quickly, hit your kids some more. Wow, I'm a dick. I'm gonna let you win this one. See what happens. Oh no, you got me. Oh no. God. See, that's the dumb thing when you're a father. You gotta let them hit you at least once. Dun, 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 dun. Surely this shouldn't be this much effort because you're up against your kid. You just killed your 10 year old son, you terrible person. Oh, your bird's dead. How did that happen? I haven't a clue. We're at the shopping mall. Nothing bad can happen at the shopping mall. 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 I don't know how to pronounce it. We're not going anywhere, are we, Jason? No, Jason. We're not going anywhere. Anywhere, J Jason. Anywhere, J Jason. So, uh, anyway, Jason, what do we. For fuck's sake, Jason! While this kid's obedient, turn around. I will smack you something silly if you do not turn around right now. Dude, you're like a meter away. Just do like two long steps and you'll be at your child. Please, Dad, come on. Oh, God, I hate this kid already. All right, my kid's, my kid's gone. My kid is going to be kidnapped, murdered, or hit by a car or something like that. I don't know. Come on, just give me the fucking wallet. Okay, and my kid has gone. What are the chances? What do you mean disappeared? Um, he, he, he's not here. That's what disappear tends to mean. This is probably the busiest shopping center I've ever seen. I've never seen a shopping center quite this busy, and yet there are no one in the shops. Why are you guys even here? To be honest, if this kid's deciding to walk off on a busy day after his father strictly told him not to, I mean, come on, this kid kind of deserves to be kidnapped or whatever's going to happen right now. Jason, where are you? Jason! Ooh, burgers! I don't think a mall is actually possible to be this busy. Get out the way, you sausage. Okay, he might be here. Jason, you're not allowed coffee. You're only 10. No, he's not here. Oh, come on, where are you, you fucking kid? What? You're not Jason. You're hideous. I mean, not saying that Jason looks good. This is the most wooden voice I have ever heard. Jason, I am so worried about you right now. It really goes well with the hugely dramatic score that's going on right now. Jason. 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 Oh, he's crossed the road. I saw him. What? He's on the other side of the road. I saw him. Why are you worrying? See that? He's there. Jason! Why would you shout to him? Oh, okay. That's his own fault, isn't it? Oh, that car has break. She was ages away. Why are you saying Jason? The car hit me. What's the problem? Oh, yeah, it just doesn't care about me. I don't even know my name to be- Where is my name? Am I Jason? Maybe that's the plot twist. Ah! A credit scene which just showcases the poor sods who don't have umbrellas. Fine, I'll get in the car, and I'll probably say some form of really wooden line with no sense of emotion. Wow, this is a very grotty house. Perfect place for a kid to live. What we got? Absolutely nothing. Uh, I think the kid's ready for beer. I think it is. Is that beer? No, put that down. We're just going to open it. I like my beers opened. Let's shoot some depressing hoops. R1, L1, shoot. And he scores. Professional. Wow, that is bouncing a lot. Your kid wasn't even looking. You're not even impressing anyone. And drink the orange juice out of the carton, you dirty sod. Where is that kid watching? It sounds demonic. Kid, what did I tell you about going to the toilet? This is my throne. And we're done. And that was pissing. So what do I need to do? Homework. Sean hasn't done his homework yet. <gasps> he hasn't? The dick. Let's get him. Do your homework later. No, I'm going to be an All obedient right. dad. No, I, I was just about to press X. Give me time. That Another great screen. newsletter from Psychopath Weekly. <laughs> My kid's sneezing. How could he? No, I'm going to be the obedient dad I was going to be originally, but then I ran out of time. Oh, your bag's right here. I apologize. Let me turn on this light switch. That did nothing. Dad, I'm finished. Can I go watch TV? Let me check the schedule. TV is not on the schedule. Let's have a review of your work and see if you're worthy of my patience. Are you trying to crack a smile? You slightly constipated. Has there always been a security camera there? What's dinner? 
Is this dinner? Am I even in the right place? Ah, my eyes! Yes, watch your life fade away in a 40 degree short spin. Hey kid, do you know how to cook? Because I have a fucking clue. Do you want me to get your dinner? Oh yeah, I'm really hungry. Well, why didn't okay, you say you fucking prick? So what are we having? We're gonna have roasted chicken. Is that crap or chipped paint all over these wardrobes? I'm hoping chipped paint. That was very fast. That can't be cooked. Am I going to kill my kid with food poisoning? It's time for bed, isn't it? <gasps> you should be in bed by now, but now you're eating. You're a terrible child. Not going to sleep at eight. Like no one does ever. Do I get anything to eat? I'm going to have an apple. Uh, no, I'm juggling. Here we go. X. Oh, I fucked up. You've impressed your child by littering. Come on. Only chance to impress your child. Don't fuck this one up. No, nearly. I couldn't even see what the button was. And ta-da. Are you impressed, child? You're not impressed, are you, child? Where the fuck did he go? I just performed an amazing juggling trick with fruit and you weren't even there to see it. I'm not tired yet. Can I stay up a little longer? No. Now, that's, <laughs> <not pretty> <laughs> <rude>. <laughs> that's what you get for not watching me juggle. Are you coming with me? Are you inviting me to bed? I'm flattered, but it's a bit wrong. It just looks like your old room and you still can't draw. Yeah, you heard me. Ah, hi kid. How's it going? I do have to say the collision on these characters is actually really good. I like the way they collide. My Sadie, please, I can't sleep without him. Why did you only really just remember that? Too bad. No, I'm going to go find it. I'm going to be a nice parent despite the fact that this kid's a dick. I know all you can think about is your brother dying. I don't, how did I not die? I'm the one who took the force of the bloody impact. Bloody kids and their brittle bones and sloppy organs. One teddy bear. Now. Deliver us to my son after I rub it on the shit in the kitchen. Hey son, prepare to be disappointed. It's the same toy you've had for years. I like the fact he presented it like it was a brand new object and a surprise, but nope. What happened to Jason wasn't your fault. If it's not my fault, then why are you so angry at me? You don't even talk to me. Who's your good boy? Who's your good boy? All right, I'm out. Peace. How do you like your door closed? Do you like it slightly closed, kind of open? Or do you like it like really partially closed so murderers can look at you during the night? And he blacked out, and now he's in the heavy rain. I see what they did there. Whoa, look at the quality of those irises. As much as I'm taking the piss out of it, this is actually a really good game. It has a really good use of the six axis. The plot is a bit slow at the moment, but obviously there are twists and turns. It's just a shame that it's taken me an hour and a half to get to this point. It looks stunning for the fact it's a three-year-old game. Like, the skin is really good, apart from the whole blackhead thing on the guy's hand when we were shaving but apart from that it all looks really good like his eyeballs were beautiful i'm just gonna check your fridge for donuts you carry on talking mm, that's good stuff yeah you carry on no it's gonna be really helpful for the investigation <laughs> so i think i should probably leave it here i've been going on for over an hour and a half now so i am looking forward to playing the rest of this game it actually is pretty gripping so far so i'm gonna have a lot of fun with it so i'm gonna leave it here for now i'm gonna leave the rest up to anyone else who wants to play it and everyone else has probably already played it because it's such an old game and oh my god Oh god, that made me jump. What is wrong with you? Oh, asthma. He needs an inhaler. All right, fair enough. Anyway, guys, my name is Keyboard Slapper, and I'll see you in the next one. What is that guy doing? Don't you touch Lauren. She's a valuable suspect. She's just swell. Now beat it, loser. Me? Beat it? How about I beat you? Hell yeah. Headbutt. Wrong button, because I thought I was using an Xbox. So he goes from having an asthma attack to beating this guy up in a matter of, I don't know, 30 seconds? Oh, put down that chair, you wuss. I know I used the lamp, but there's an extent. X. Oh, lucky you're not my kid. I don't have to let you win. Gah! I'm ruining this girl's apartment, and I feel quite bad. Triangle, triangle, triangle. He's got glass. He's got glass. Oh, shit. Oh, he's going to cut me. He's going to cut me. Don't you cut me. Don't you cut me. Don't you cut me. I need to do an outro. You're ruining my outro. No, don't use the head. Oh, ow, ow, oh, don't. Oh, in the face. Oh, KO. Well, that was dramatic. Well, anyway, before I was so rudely interrupted, I was doing my outro. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Farewell. Your face, Jason!